part. So you have some cornmeal, some parsley, some Chinese eggplant, ginger, chayoki squash, some coconut, some beets, some black beans, pigeon peas, pink beans, some cabbage, some baby bananas. Just a little mini haul. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new. I'm Flore and I tried to do a dinner life vlog yesterday. Time got away from me to be honest with you. So I have a couple clips of when we went grocery shopping. I'll share that with you. But I really wanted to come on camera because I rarely get to do it. The boys are sleeping at the same time right now. It's amazing. So I wanted to take advantage, but I do want to thank the mob fam. They gave me a shout out and Kanisha also gave me a shout out. And I think her channel is called Growing Healing Self Love. I couldn't believe it. Like they gave me shout outs and thank you, thank you, thank you. I feel like the best thing you can give somebody is, their t is your time. And the fact that they shared out my content just means the world to me. So speaking about that, I, I don't really know too much about YouTube. I'm learning as I go along, but I do have like the community tab and I tend to do better off camera uh, i was hoping if it's okay with you guys that i would share some other content creators that i truly love and i i mean i'm all in their their channel all the time commenting you know that i'm really into them i can tell you their name not to be creepy i can tell you so much about them so if that's okay with you guys i would love to share other people that i have found and they have helped me in so many ways sharing different tips teaching me different things so if it's okay i would like to start doing that just um sharing different channels on my community tab you never know who you might connect with you never know what you can learn from them and it's free you know i like to say that so real quickly i'm going to show you some of the items that we picked up for joshua's birthday celebration uh, he is having his first birthday photo shoot and we like to have the boys pick out their things. Like we kind of see what they gravitate to, what are their interests. Like for Michael, he was into dinosaurs at that time. So that's what we did for his birthday thing. Joshua, he's into cars. Matter of fact, I'll put like a little clip somewhere where Joshua is actually saying car. Car? Car? Joshua, car? Car. Good job. Car? Car? Car. <laughs> so that's why his theme is cars. And I'm not talking about like the Disney cars. I'm talking about just like cars, like transportation, like <laughs> like cars. So real quickly, this is his little outfit for his pictures. I hope you guys can see it. In the back, it says Joshua and the number one. I got this from an Etsy shop. I love shopping at Etsy because it's, you know, small business owners, a lot of home-based businesses, and I like to support them because at one point I had an Etsy shop myself. So I really like this outfit. And we were able to get the Converse in his size. If you saw the last vlog when we went shoe shopping, we were able to pick that up. So I will, um, I will show that later or you'll see it when we go do his photo shoot. Like I said, I've been staying up all night, me and my cricket just burning the midnight candle working on Joshua's decorations. You, you don't see it, but it's like a hot mess all around me. But this is his cake topper. I'll try to put a picture so you can have a closer look. This is his cake topper that I made him for his um, pictures. Because for his actual birthday party, we have, um, we purchased a cake from like a uh, cake artists I, I don't know what they're called but a cake artist uh, so he won't need a cake topper for that so oh, I still have some extra cutouts and I'll try to share some of the crafting with you guys if not in this vlog in another vlog so I have some cutouts that I still need to work on I like to keep them organized so I don't miss any pieces so that's what I have here and you probably see all the other stuff in the background and on Amazon, I picked out this template because I do my own balloon garlands, but I struggle with having them the right size. So I decided to try um, the balloon sizer box. 
so all my balloons will be the same size and be universal. Anything that I can link, I will post them in the description box if you're interested. And these are some of the items I picked up on Amazon. I probably should have tried to open this prior to coming on camera. Okay, so this right here, it's the color, um, the color painted books. All you need is water, so it's, it saves me time and not a lot of mess. And I'll show you guys a clip of Michael utilizing this book. What we like to do is read it to them and then they are able to paint after we're done reading the story. And you can also find different things like they'll have questions for your child. I really like this. And so this right here is for Joshua. Same one is for Michael. And this one's for Michael as well because he had one of these already. He had it for over a year. Like he probably had it when he was nine months old. I like, I know it says like you, you have to be like three or something, but anytime that I purchase something for my boys, I do it with them. I don't just let them do it on their own. So um, he had used this so much to the point it's so bad. We had to replace it. And as Joshua gets older, he'll get one of these as well. And again, I'll try to link everything down in the description box. Hopefully I can remember. This is another repurchase. Michael already had one, but all the pieces are gone. I think I took them. I was doing like a sensory basket for him and I used those letters. And I think after I cleaned up, I placed it somewhere that I can't remember. But now Joshua really is into it and they're like fighting over the little book bag. So what did I do? I purchased two new ones and they were on set at the time that I purchased so that helped. And this is the little straps for the backpack. So this is the Leapfrog ABC Alphabet Book. All right, this is it. You've probably seen this before if you don't already have one, but you know you hear Mr. Pencil all the time. So this is gonna be for Michael. And what I probably do is I probably use my Cricut and put their name on it so that way Michael will know which one is his and Joshua will know Jay is mine, you know, because he knows, like, he responds when we call his name. And Michael does a really good job at understanding what is for him and what is for Joshua. It's the same thing so i don't think i need to open this for you guys it's the same thing so this is what it came in this is what it looks like and then i got this right here this is like the crinkle um paper i'm gonna use this for joshua's centerpieces for his birthday party so i have these little 10 10 pins 10 pails, that's what it's called, 10 pails that I'm gonna put them in and then some of these little um, paper decoration will be part of his centerpieces and I'll share that with you guys as I do them, I guess. And this is the last item. So a while ago in several different vlogs, I talked about trying to um, learn how to plant. I even purchased some like starter kits from Target. They're still here. I never tried again, but now I have these planter pots. And then I think husband Michael picked up some, oh, I'm probably gonna say it wrong, some planter soil. I don't know, I'm still learning. So that's why I purchased these so we can start planting. Honestly, I still need to contact our um, HOA to see what we are permitted to plant in our backyard. Don't want to get fined, so <laughs> I have to figure that out. But I think we can do some starter plants inside of our home and that shouldn't be an issue. So that's why we got that. And I feel like that's pretty much it. I just honestly, I just really wanted to go on camera because I rarely get to do it and just tell you guys, thank you so much for all the love and all the support. I wanted to um, thank Kanisha and the Mob family for giving me a shout out. It means so much to me. 
that's it you guys i'm starting to ramble now i tend to do that because i always home with my kids but anyway thank you so much for watching if you're new here and you want to be part of our family we'll love to have you go ahead and subscribe and until next time you guys bye